Hey everyone, this is Bad But Sweaty, and in this video I wanted to quickly discuss a post from the Vigor Devs on their newsletter that has a few hints towards what may be coming in Season 17. I will leave a link in the description to the newsletter if you'd like to subscribe to it yourself. I also wanted to run a giveaway with some Season 16 codes that Chris was kind enough to provide us. Without any further delay, let's get started. <laughs> First, the giveaway. I have a bunch of Xbox Battle Pass codes and a couple of both Switch and PlayStation Crown codes. All you have to do to earn a code is make friends with another Outlander in any mode. Post the clip of it on YouTube, or get it to me however else you can, Discord, etc, you know, and link the video in the comments. The codes are region locked to North America, so I'm sorry if you live elsewhere, but any code you win will not work. That's all for the giveaway. Good luck. Now, the newsletter post. It's a short gajif of a nuke going off in the distance, and a burning page of a newspaper gliding towards the camera. This newspaper has a couple interesting pieces of information on it such as the headlines, new leaderboards added, more diverse statistics, and what I think says President Reveals New Air Weapon, but I could be wrong here, the first two words are a little blurred. For the first sentence, the message is quite obvious. There will be more stats added to the leaderboards in Season 17. The second one is more vague and less legible, so take my opinions with a grain of salt here. New air weapon could mean a weapon that comes from the sky, such as the nuke going off in the background, or an air-powered gun, such as an air rifle. Those or we're going to be seeing people load into encounters wielding cans of pressurized air to literally blow their targets away. <laughs> The next piece of information I found interesting is the date on the newspaper, 1988. The events of Vigor are set just a few years after this date in 1991, where it seems Norway has already been in ruin for a while. This leads me to believe that the gif from the newsletter is from the day the nukes were dropped to end the war in Norway, and is also the birthday of the Outlands. The last thing I found interesting was the location this Gujif takes place in. Looking at the area, it's clearly in Fjellkanten, down near the Crash Chopper POI. This is evidenced by the bulletin board and the oil barrel sitting on a rough path leading past the mountain where a destroyed helicopter would soon sit. I don't think this will have anything to do with Season 17, I just thought it was worth noting. With all that being said, this has been Bad But Sweaty from the Christopher Beast channel. Have a nice day.